big game this weekend. There's been a lot of build up to it, but it's easy to forget. It's actually a, a big game because both teams are on 10 points, second and fourth in the league, I think. So we can't lose sight of that. So it's an important match this weekend, despite the occasion. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I mean, obviously the occasion makes it even even more, you know, of an important game. Um, but I think, you know, the, the girls have just got to be and do what they've been doing. You know, they've, they've been playing well, we've con been consistent, um, we've been difficult to score against, we've been scoring at the other end. So, you know, we've got to go down the, the same route. Um, we know Liverpool are a, are, a, are a good side, they're up there on merit. Um, you know, obviously they've um, they've recruited quite quite big in the summer, and um, you know they're one of the fancy sides to go up. And um, but from our point of view, you know we're playing well and we've just got to concentrate on us. Yeah, and like you say, four unbeaten. Obviously, we got the point at Crystal Palace last weekend, going in in good form. And you know, with the occasion there it is, lots of fans coming down, fantastic stadium. It's it's one just for everyone to look forward to, isn't it? Oh, without a doubt. Yeah, I mean these are games that you you look forward to that you want to play in. You know, to play at Bramall Lane and you know to have a decent crowd. Is, is you know is great for the girls and um, you know I, I I just want them to go out and be themselves because they've been performing so well um, you know we're, we're a good football side we play good football you know we compete you know we wear the shirt with pride we make sure that we compete in every game and um, you know we want to try and give Liverpool a good game. Yeah, from a personal point of view, how much are you looking forward to just sitting in that dugout and, and on the touchline at Bramall Lane on Saturday? Oh yeah, it's good. It's, you know, you, you, you're back in you know a fantastic stadium. It's great, you know, and that's no slant on Chesterfield because we're lucky to play there as well. But um, you know, it's it's great for me. It's great for the girls. Um, you know, I just want to try and train the minds on the fact that it's another game. You know, we're, we're on a good run of form. We don't have to be anything than what we've been doing. You know, because that's been enough. Um, but we just need to start quick. We need to start, you know, straight out of the blocks and, um, you know, make sure that we turn up. Yeah, both the games against Liverpool last season were very, very close. Two one nil defeats. Obviously, in the second one, we missed a couple of penalties. Obviously, one in stoppage time, which would have pretty much guaranteed a point. If you look back at those games in terms of a reference point for this weekend, um, I think maybe one swallow this season was the fact the the, the Durham result. You know, because the top three we struggled to get past um, Durham, um, Liverpool. You know, and obviously Leicester City, you know, they, they were the games that were tight that we just couldn't get the right side of, you know, and we've already just beaten one of them, you know, this season. So, I mean, I'm hoping that's a good sign. Um, we know it's going to be tough. I know on his day we're capable of beating anybody in this league. That's a fact because of the players that we've brought in and the type of characters that they are. Um, but, you know, once you cross that white line at three o'clock, it's about, it's about the day, it's about the occasion, it's about playing the game, um, you know, and it's, it's there to be enjoyed. Yeah, and squad-wise, it feels like for sort of every player we get back, we're, we're losing another one at the minute. But obviously, Reema's still out. Me yeah. is away on international duty. But you got Bex Rayner back on the pitch last week. She was excellent as well for the 20 minutes she came on. And you had Thea back in the squad as well. And they, it's a real welcome boost to have both of them back. Oh, without a doubt. You know, I mean, Bex gives us that, gives us that craft. You know, and that that link between midfield and attack. And obviously, Thea's naturally left-footed, and she gives us that balance on the left-hand side. You know, a fantastic little player. Um, so great to have them two back. You know, it's a shame we've not got Rima. You know, because obviously she's, you know, she's she's influential in what we do, and, and Ellie Wilson as well. It was, you know, it was a really good defender. Um, but like you say, pe people are starting to just come back now. Um, it just bolsters the squad a little bit. You know, we've had a lot of young players in and around the squad, which is great. I love that because you know they, they affect the environment. You know, they're enthusiastic, they're infectious with other players. You know, they make players want to train and play. Um, so we've got a good we've got a good blend, we've got a good balance.